Attention, all units dispatch back in channel. Metro calling 1 Adam 15. Go for 1 Adam 15. Metro calling 1 Adam 2. Go for 2. 1 Adam 15, 1 Adam 2, can I have you en route to 389 Alter Street? 389 Alter Street at the Arcadius building, Arcadius building. For security request, for the 43, you'll be finding your cat. Stand by for call attachment. Show you five nine CEO on scene. Well, that was some great timing. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. You greedy, useless bastards. They're all just a bunch of self centered. Sir, morons. sir, what? what? Commander Henry with the LSPD, you okay? No, I'm not okay. These assholes are trying to get me to leave the building. I'm just trying to collect some fucking insurance money. Okay, okay. You wanna just come over here and talk with me over here? Let's just take a breath, okay? All right. God, they pissed me off. So you said about the in insurance? What's the insurance for, sir? Just... My father recently passed away, and I, I don't have the $20,000 to pay for some grave and tombstone and cat. I don't, there's just too much. I I have okay. insurance, but these fucking assholes told me no, that there's some loophole, and I don't know. Okay. I understand, sir. Okay. So, we just got a 911 call, okay, about a guy down here that the security have asked to leave the premises, okay? And I'm... My guess is you, and I'm gonna have another unit come down here and they'll check that out, okay, and stuff like that, but for right now, they want you to leave the area, okay? Of course they do. Okay, well, I, sir, sir, I think the issue is it's quite late in the evening and everyone's starting to knock off work, okay? So, so what I think, what I think is going on here is if you come back down tomorrow once you've had, a, you know, a night's rest and a night to sleep on you and you've calmed down a bit, then you can come back in the morning and try and sort the insurance issue out, okay? I guess, I guess. Because, because let's be, let's be honest, nothing's going to be accomplished right now while you're angry, okay? Because they're not going to let you back in, okay? And they're, they're closing down for the night, okay? Yeah, I, I understand. Just, so this is all so much. Yeah, I'm sorry for your loss, sir, okay? I really am, but... Thank you. But right now, I think the best thing for you to do is just go home, you know, relax, get your, get your head back on straight, and then come back down here in the morning, okay? Oh, okay. I'll, I'll do that. Okay. Do you need a lift home or anything, sir? No, no, my... Okay. My car's parked up. Okay, just, just for my report, what's your name, sir? My name's, uh, Daniel Hempsey. Alright, Daniel, just hang out here for one sec, okay? Okay. Sergeant. Commander. <clears throat> Fucking kidding me. Yeah, that's him. Mirror Park. Yeah. Okay, so is requesting assistance in removing a white male with brown hair. White t-shirt. Yeah, that's definitely him. Hey, Sarge, are you able to just go and check with those security guards and just make sure um, that they definitely just want him off the property? Alright. Thanks. Alright, yeah. Daniel, so you said you, you, you know, you're able to get home and all that, you've got transportation? Yeah, yeah, my car is parked in the, the parking garage. Okay. 
My colleague over there, he's just going to go and have a quick chat with the security guards, find out exactly what's going on, and then you'll be free to go, okay? Uh, okay. Okay. Do you, do you need any water or anything like that? Uh, uh, no, I know I'm, I'm okay. Okay. You got any kids or, or you got any kids, Mr. Hempsey? I have one kid. It's a little girl. One kid, a little girl. Okay. I bet you she's a handful. Oh, she is. She just finished her terrible twos. Oh. I see. Yeah. Uh, they just want him out of here. They're coming okay. soon. All right. All right, Mr. Hempsey, you're gonna be free to go this time. Okay. Just, okay. just like I said, go home, get a good night's rest, come down here with a clear head, because I don't want to have to come back down here tomorrow, okay? So just get a good night's sleep, relax, come down here and try to have a civil conversation, okay, with these guys, okay? Yeah, I understand. Alright, Mr. Hemsey, you have a good night. You, you too, Commander. Alright. Have a good night. Oh, that's, that's an unlucky one, that one. What happened with him? Uh, his father passed away and um, he can't afford a funeral and all that, so he's trying to get the insurance money. But um, like I just said to him, you know, you're down here late. You know, they're trying to close up for the night and, you know, you're pretty angry and hot-headed at the moment. It's best to come back in the morning and just, you know, try and have a civil conversation. Yeah, yeah just bring in all your paperwork. That'll be better for him. Yeah. Those things take ages to do. Yeah, but he seems he seems okay now. I think I think it just got heated between him and the security guards, and they just needed someone to come down here and calm it down. By the looks of it. Yeah. Sounds like it. All right. All right. Yeah, I just left I court remember. and I was just heading this way. Actually, that's why I was here so quick. I could see you didn't take any much time getting in here. The the call literally came in when I was at those lights, pretty much. Oh, I was further down the street on the other side, actually. So oh, okay. Cut through. All right, so be I'll safe. You too, Commander. Five nine CEO to Central. Show me back tonight. Ten four one Adam two. One Adam two back tonight. Okay, yeah. so we wanted him to back in. Oh, Metro calling one Adam 15. One Adam 15. Metro calling one Adam 2. One Adam 2. Metro calling one Adam 10. One Adam 10. One Adam 15, one Adam 2, one Adam 10. Can I have you en route to 431 in Mirror Park? 431 Mirror Park in the island. For reports of guy with shots fired, the subject is a white male wearing black beanie, white t-shirt, jeans, white shoes, wristwatch, and is reported to be shooting a pistol. 5-9, see you at a central en route. 10 4 10-4. 10-4. Five nine Toyota Central on scene shots fired. Sounds like it's coming from the south end of the park. Yeah, for caller advice that uh, subject is on the island in the middle of the park. Copy. Oh, I see him.
Five nine Toyota Central. I got eyes on the suspect. He's on the bridge. Be advised, I believe I know this guy. He's on the footpath on the south side of the bridge. One item ten on team. One item zero just in traffic. Daniel, it's Commander Henry. Stay back. Daniel, I need you to put down stay, the gun. Stay the fuck back. Okay, okay. I'm gonna stay I'm here. Fucking around. You wanna tell me what's going on? I can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore. Daniel, you can't do what? Daniel, stop. Stop. You need to talk to me, Daniel. You can't do what? I am in over my fucking head with bills. Okay. Bills upon God. Damn okay. It. I can't. We can talk about this, okay? Stop. Daniel, Daniel, can you do me a favor? What? What can do you, you just, want? Can you just try and stand still and just talk to me, okay? Can you just, just talk to me? That's all I want, okay? I can't fucking do this anymore. All right. Are you going to keep your gun down there? I don't want to hurt anybody. Okay, I'm gonna. Goddamn close. Okay, okay. I'm gonna stay right here, okay? Ma'am, you need to. Ma'am. Daniel, Daniel, I just need you to talk to me, okay? What do you. What do you want? I just want to talk to you, Daniel, okay? Have you had Hi. anything to drink? Daniel. You gotta talk to me, okay? I just, I just had a few fucking years. Okay. So. Okay. Is this because of earlier at the um, at the insurance company? Those fucking greedy bastards. Okay. Is that is that what this is about, though? I don't have any fucking money. I have a family. I need. Hey, to Daniel. Daniel, just. Just... I am in over my fucking head with bills upon bills and okay. I, just, I, I can't do this anymore. Okay, so did you come down here to blow off some steam? What exactly is going on? Why have you got a gun, Daniel? I just, I just want to leave. I, just, I can't be here anymore. Okay, I'm going to lower my weapon, okay? Okay? Okay. Okay. Alright. If you keep your gun down there, I'll keep mine down here, okay, as well, okay? We can just talk about this, okay? There's there's nothing to talk about. Okay. It's, there's, a, there's only one solution to this goddamn problem, this godforsaken world that's going to shit. What's the solution, Daniel? The way out. Where I don't have to deal with this shit anymore. My Dan family would be better off without me. Daniel, they wouldn't. You've got a two... You've got a... You've got a young toddler, a daughter. You said she just come out of her terrible she, she, twos. She'd be better off without me as a fucking father. Do you, th do you really think that, Daniel? <sighs> I'm, I'm gonna guess she talks. Yes, she talks. What does she call you, Dad? Calls me Papa. Does she call anybody else that? No. Exactly. Because she loves you. She's not going to be better off without you. Where? You'd you'd only be taking out the you'd only be doing it the easy way yourself, and then she's got to go through exactly what you're going through right now. She's going to lose her father just like you lost yours. You really want to put her through that? I don't want to put anyone through anything. I just can't. I've sunk my damn family in bills that I can't pay. Daniel, there's... And I... I just can't. There's a way out of this, okay? What? what what's the way out of this? Please enlighten me. Daniel, there's help. We can get you help, okay? Oh. You mean what fucking therapists that make money off of people and I, their problems? I didn't say therapy, Daniel. Daniel, I didn't say therapy, okay? But right now, you're talking 
You're talking about harming yourself, okay? You've, you've got a daughter. I'm not going to shoot you. Please. I shoot you and then what? I've got to go to your home and I've got to tell your wife and I've got to tell your daughter that you were shot by the police. You think they want to hear that at nearly midnight tonight? That that's what happened? Ding dong. Hmm? What, and then I meant to, what, sit there with your wife and your daughter and and they cr they're there crying and... Because you took the easy way out? Well, what's the alternative? That, what, I stay alive and I sink my family in debt that they could never get away from and then we'd be homeless and... Daniel, and there's, there's programs, there's groups, there's organizations out there to help people like you in this situation, okay? This isn't the and solution. You think they'd help me. Yes. The same goddamn company that told me that they would ensure my family, if one of my loved ones, ever got hurt, and I got nothing. I got nothing. Daniel, don't. Daniel, we don't need to worry about that right this second, okay? Right now, this is about you and your family. And you think you can fix that? No. I, I can't fix it. I can offer help and solutions, but I can't fix it and... It's hard. Trust me. I know losing my father is hard. I've been there. You lost your father? Yeah, I did. When I was very young. I'm sorry for your loss. A lot younger than you are. I know what it's like to lose a loved one. How, how do you do it then? How do you get over? You don't. There's not a single day, not one day that goes by that I don't think of my father. It doesn't get... It doesn't go away. The pain doesn't just disappear. It just gets easier to live with. It doesn't feel easy. Some days it's not easy, no. Some, some days I... I don't even want to go to work, but... I pushed myself to go to work because my father would have wanted me to. My father wouldn't want me to kill myself or go and get drunk every night just because he died. He'd want me doing what I love to do, which is my job. So I go out each day and I try and make him proud the way he'd want and the way he would have watched me because I know he would have been proud. Just like I know your father would be proud of you. Now, right? <laughs> just like let's say, just let's like say that, that this. Look at what I've done. What have you done? I'm here terrorizing a bunch of people. Do you think that I wouldn't get in trouble for something like you this? You brought a gun down to the park. It accidentally went off. <sighs> you haven't done anything too serious that you can't come back from, Daniel. Just don't want to hurt my family. They've been through it now. Exactly. So, so what I need you to do, Daniel, is put down the gun, okay? Just put it down. Just put down the gun. You don't need the gun, Daniel. You don't need the gun. What do you think your daughter would say if she saw you right here, right now? I don't know. You do know that, Daniel. You do know. She would jump in my arms. Exactly. Sorry about that. Exactly, so put the gun down. Put the gun down, Daniel. Okay. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna have to put you in cuffs. Okay, it's just for your safety, okay? Oh my god. Okay. Come with me, Daniel. Let's go this way. One item to show one in cuffs. Okay. 
Do you remember Sergeant Ahmed over here? You met him earlier as well? <laughs> yeah, I remember. Okay. Sergeant Ahmed's gonna look after you now, okay? And I'm gonna check in with you later, okay? Okay. Alright. He's yours for now, Sergeant. Alright, Commander. Alright, sir, just come over and come with me. It's all gonna be okay, sir.